I enjoyed the 2020 inauguration greatly. It's good to see a smooth transition to our next president and the executive branch of government. I loved all of the inspiring talks and smiles and smartness and heart on display. I do think a lot can be done at the higher levels of government. And, it's important to remember that local change happens locally. During the last couple years of the previous administration it became clearer and clearer to me that in order to affect change around me we were going to have to organize locally. No matter what issue you care about there are different levers to make change happen. I have been working on banning gas-powered leaf blowers for instance. This is a perfect example of the national, if not international problem. We've built and used a tool that is detrimental to the user and everyone who has to suffer the noise and air pollution from the use of the tool. At the federal level, sure, someday these will be outlawed across the land. But until that day it's going to take a lot of work on the local level. Our group, QCPDX.org has efforts at the neighborhood, city, county, and metro level going on. The one that's had the most effect on my life is the campaign I've had going on the Nextdoor.com platform for the past five years. I have no doubt that by reminding my neighbors of the danger of gas-powered leaf blowers to their health and quality of living eventually their use will cease. It's already begun. I don't have exact proof that this has happened, but I hear leaf blowers less often and further away each day. So if you have something that's bugging you or ways you want to make your local world better try working at the local level. Join your neighborhood association. Post on nextdoor.com. Talk to the people on your block. It takes work to make change, but you would be surprised at how much you can accomplish by focusing on the world right near you. You can do it. Get started today.